it's your girl Natalia Natalia Spencer and today I'm going to give you a realistic reset day in my life which I will be cleaning um, doing my hair because I haven't washed my hair in like two weeks which is bad but I haven't been feeling like myself lately I've been really tired so when I do get my day off I don't clean or anything I sleep a whole lot and sometimes I just don't have the energy so today when I got up, I'm like, all right, so I took back to back day offs and I need to take one of the day offs to do something, which is clean my area. I have new clothes, which I have to put away. And then um, I have clothes that I washed like weeks ago that I haven't put away. So I'm going to do that today and just try to get my area in order so I can be a little bit motivated today. So guys, I actually, let me set my camera up. Good. All right, so I actually ordered clothes a few weeks ago because I was supposed to go on, on a vacation in January, but I ended up going to New York instead. And um, whew, right now I can try the clothes. I'll tell you why in like a few weeks, but they, don't really fit anymore and I know Jenny's is going to make use when she gets here for now but there was a whole um lot more items in here so as you can see I have empty bags here um but yeah I have to pack these out and then I'm going for a bath in the living room because those stuff need to pack up as well. Not. I'm going to wear these soon. Soon enough. They're extremely cute. Like I just can't. Since so I'm here pulling out the clothes, I'm going to actually show you what I got. I think so I normally shop on different websites. I think this is the first time I'm buying like solely everything on sheen um just because i couldn't find what i wanted on other sites and in december i always go for like black stuff like that so i wasn't pleased with going on other websites so i got everything for my december um looks and then the vacation i was supposed to go on on sheen and i was pleased i mean my first is this leather pants here that I just love. I'm going to post a picture with me in the leather pants. I love this pants. I actually um got this top here. I don't know if I can link the stuff when I'm finished. I actually got this top here to match with the pants. Again, I wore this with another top in December for my birthday. Um this comes with this like bikini top. And there is like an overall to go over, as I said, vacation stuff. This dress that I wore a few weeks ago, I'm going to put a picture there so you can see. And I love the material of this dress. I feel like when I started to buy from Sheen at first, like when nobody really knew about Sheen. The, you had to worry about the quality items you were getting but now i feel like i don't even have to read a review i'm getting quality stuff from sheen especially like sheen sexy sheen bay sheen petite etc i also got this dress oh it's inside out like a glove right now i don't feel sexy enough to be wearing sexy stuff but i mean i love this yep all right i don't normally 
hair pattern but as I said vacation stuff and I ended up getting this short set cute shorts with this top I'm so excited for this vacation now I have to plan all over again I don't know if I'm going to make it to my Turks trip um you'll see why soon but I just hope I get to but this is the top and the shorts also got this skirt this was a part of my December look but I did not wear it I don't think I really like it I don't know probably when I put it on and pair it so it was supposed to go with this shirt here but I feel like I'm going to end up wearing this I love this top by the way I think I'm going to end up wearing this with a uh, pants that has the cut down low here This dress, when I say quality, I mean quality. Now it has rhinestones here, which you know comes packaged properly, so it protects it. But I actually, this dress fits like a glove. I just love it, and I cannot wear to wear it when I can again. So this is a part of my December notebook as well. Got this from Sheen Sexy. And um, I mean, I can still wear this now because it's stretchy. Did I show you guys everything? Oh, Lord, I forgot these shorts. And I'm going to wear these shorts. I mean guys I really really love leather I love black overall black and white and nude and it's the first time ordering so much blue items I think my friends are a little bit shocked No, honestly, I don't even know if the camera is like recording this good. I should turn it around, but for the purpose. All right, I really do love this top. It is a little bit thin, so if you're not comfortable enough, you're going to have to get like a black bra to wear. As you can see, you can see right through. But I don't want to just wear my clothes like this. Um. In the night time, <laughs> not daytime. Right, this is another one of my December looks that I was supposed to wear, but I did not. So this is an all-in-one as well, and it comes with um, a lining inside. And it is see-through and then a top that barely fits but fits so this was one of my favorite looks I was like so excited to wear on vacation when my cousin came here and she actually spent her birthday in Jamaica and she wore something similar to this I was like I love it I have to get one um, and this is pretty popular as well on Sheen, but I was like, okay, I just still have to get it. And I can wear it now with what's happening. So, I love it. It comes with this to put underneath the top in case you want to wear it open, but I'm going to wear mine closed. Then, of course, swimsuits. What's a vacation when I was swimsuit? I actually got three swimsuits. I wore two. I wore one yesterday and I wore one a few weeks ago. 
and this is the last one which is white with the top and everything that you see here is extra small because that's what I wear then I love this so this is a top as well I'm going to post that picture but I love this um makes me feel like you know a little Italian lady on the beach put on a big party my linen suit yeah so this top with this short I actually got the wedge to wear with this outfit here um I'm going to wear this soon pretty pretty soon like I'm not even going to waste them this is the clothes that I have worn over the past few weeks no pack up or nothing so now I have to do all of that pack it up Alright, so the reason why I often take a lot of time to pack up my clothes is because I actually color coordinate, so I do nudes. Um, I have a draw with like colors, sorry. Oh. So I do like oranges here, nudes here again, greens here, nudes, whites. I need to organize this draw again. Um, and blues here and blacks here, right? These are like going out tops. And I organize my drawers based on how I wear things. These are like Aaron clothes. And then in my closet, I actually do the same. So I have whites. I do the transition white, silver, blue, pinks, nudes, blues, and blacks. You know, I love my black. And then I do the same thing with my shoes, which I need to fix up here um, when I'm done and actually put up other heels that I have. But yeah. All right. So to sort out my clothes, what I actually do is all right. So to sort out my clothes, I actually put like my errand stuff together, my things that I wear in the yard, and then the things that need to go in the closet. Oh, I have stuff over here too. So errands, closets, everything here needs to go in my closet. Honestly guys, sometimes when I do look at the amount of clothes I have, and sometimes I only wear them like once, twice, except my errands clothes, I wear the same clothes over and over again to ultra rails. Whoever see me in my clothes are my clothes. <laughs> like I wear the same errands clothes over and over once they're on the top, which is I normally go for like a tights and just like a top, either like a t-shirt or a crop top, always and mostly in black, right? Um, I'm currently building, so I do have a problem with closet space that I don't have anywhere to put my shoes um, and then just to really color coordinate my closet I don't have space for that for my jeans stuff like that because um, if you notice I didn't show you jeans just now because I have them stacked on a shelf and then I have to pack my handbags up it's like a whole mess there but I try to keep it as organized as possible and then I use my mother's closet sometimes which is bad but i am currently building and i think my closet is a tiny bit small my contractor is saying it's not as small i don't think he realized that i do have a lot of stuff so they're saying when i put shelves and so on in there it's going to be longer be it's they're saying when i put shelves etc in there it's going to appear bigger um, because I'll see the amount of space, storage space I have, but I don't like, it's like, no, we Jamaicans, we love, like, dress and something. I hate seeing those stuff. I literally want my bedroom with just my bed, my bedside tables, and a makeup table. A chase lounge, and that is it. 
I don't want that the drawers and stuff like that. So while cleaning, I actually That's decided to take out everything from the drawers just to look what i'm wearing now and what i'm not wearing so i can donate the rest of stuff to charity because that that's what i normally do i send these stuff to my grandmother and she um donates them so i don't just uh, wear clothes and waste them i actually give them to girls who actually need them and they're not bad clothes either So I left the drawers for a while and I'm actually going to start on the closet sections. I'm just taking out some um, hangers as well as some uh, clothes <laughs> that I don't think should be in the hanger. And I'm going to put them in the drawer and just sort that whole section out. So from doing my drawers to my closet actually took me um, two hours because I like to, I mean, as I said before, color coordinate and I like to know where to find my things easily. And I think folding <laughs> took up a lot of time, but guys, I actually like folding clothes. Um, it's therapeutic. I just the whole facts I may for put the colors there so color there so unfold it properly. Why I take so long to pack up my clothes in case my mother is watching this video. Oh, and after this, I didn't end up washing my hair until like in the night time um, because I was just so over it, to be honest, over it. All right, don't judge me for this area. I haven't cleaned here in a while. I mean, even my goddaughter's um, clips and um, toys are here. Uh, I will be cleaning my brushes, but not today, probably tomorrow, because I know I'm going to be tired after this and just like the whole process, I don't feel like going through. But I do need to clean the area because you know, everywhere I forget, dust don't wipe down, you know, one time.
all right so i'm finally finished the only thing i didn't do today was clean my brushes because i could not i was done for the day but i actually re need to repaint my room but because i'm moving i don't feel like it's necessary right now um so i reorganized there did my bed and finish with my closet and my drawers i'm actually going to do something more aesthetically pleasing when i'm finished to show you the end product so here we go